All clear. Michelle Martin. The army. Okay, wow. Yeah, that's me. I work here. I used to. I, uh... Look, I know what you're thinking, and I swear we had no idea this was going to happen. Actually, um... Should I talk to a lawyer? If you can find one, you're more than welcome. Right now, we need to clean out this office. Can you help me find what we need? Of course. And you'll tell them I cooperated, right? Almost done. I'm so glad you're here. Hey, where we're going, are they still putting people in jail for stuff? Not that I should go to jail or anything. That's all the financial stuff, spreadsheets, account statements. You don't need these lab reports, do you? Miss Martin, that's pretty much the only thing we want. Oh, right. Sure. orders were just to bring back those documents but I, I can't leave you here come on we're here stay near the landing zone until the helicopter gets here as long as you don't do anything stupid we'll keep you alive thank you Mortar team, fire barrage on my smoke.
got a feral out there. Last man. I wrote, this is Black Friday. We have Michelle Martin inbound with a stack of documents. There's plenty of room on the landing pad, Black Friday. Be ready for another extraction when we have the intel. I wrote out. Feels good to be done. That's the second time the army has swept in and rescued one of our callers. Has something gone wrong with the chain of command? Because I know the army has officially pulled out of Danforth. I'll take whatever help we can get, but listeners, keep your eyes open. It doesn't take much for an army to turn into a mob. She's just a ray of sunshine, ain't she? What's his connection to Dr. Horn? None. This is a separate opportunity. FEMA is a no-show. So, the governor is relying on private business owners to set up supply lines and refugee shelters. 
The kid you're after, Hadley Weston. His family owns the biggest food shipping network in the region. We need to keep the Westons working with us. Your orders are to go get their son. I rode out. No room for that. This is Sasquatch calling Black Friday. Requesting additional forces at my position inside the Highway 9 tunnel. Black Friday to... Who is this again? I've been listening to you pokes yammer on the radio for a couple days now, doing your best to fuck up the apocalypse. So how about we argue call signs later after you fucking come out here and reinforce my ass? Get off this frequency, buddy. This is for grown-up army work, not whatever it is you're doing. What I'm doing is saving the damn world shit for brains. I got the key to fixing this whole mess right here in my pack. What I don't have is a way out of this damn tunnel. You want to get out of this mess alive? I suggest you send me a fucking extraction. Is this guy for real? <laughs> I don't know, but this is the best show I've had since the lights went out. I say we go get this guy. Survivors, we have a caller. Why don't you tell us your situation? Look, when I thought this was all gonna pass, I sort of looted some stuff from the grocery store. Now the world is fucked and I've got way too much stuff. It's yours if you come pick me up. Time you showed up. Let's get my high speed low drag ass back to your base. Your name is Sasquatch? My name is His Holiness Sergeant Kelly Eldridge III. Fucking Esquire. All right. You know, I could have left you back in that tunnel. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize this was a fucking daycare. Gotta learn to say please and thank you. What's this miracle you say you're toting around? You ain't got the clearance. No, I ain't got the patience. Just get me back to base to talk to my handler, all right? clear this whole thing right the hell up.
I don't know any Sergeant Eldridge. We had an agency operation over a doghouse before it went dark. Not much chance of contacting them now. So this guy's legit, General? I have no idea. I'd guess your guy is Special Activities Division, but what he was doing in there, anybody's guess. I'll tell you what I was doing. Getting tissue samples from one of those armless, noisy freaks. My handler said this biopsy is worth me risking my funky ass. So do you people want it or not? If it's intel on the Zeds, we want it. Put Sergeant Eldridge on the next bird. Not yet. I got a whole list of freaks to get through first. Oh, and without my handler, I'm gonna need access to your intel. Sir? Can you afford to turn down another rifle? Take him on. Roger that. But he's not going on another freak hunting mission without an escort. Rescuing him once is enough. You want our intel, you're under our command. Got it? Oh, yes sir. So I guess you're my commanding officer now. Well, by your leave, boss. Can I pretty please continue my operation? I found what we needed. You ready for this shit? Stay calm, I'm on the way. Yo, come on! I use a bay here! Can't believe the Zeds didn't hear that. Can't carry that much. You ready for this shit? My handler had me collecting tissue samples from the freaks. You know, the Zeds that feature enhanced person murdering capabilities. We've killed plenty of those already if you want to go through the pile. It's not that easy. I need them in good condition. That means killing them in a certain way and I get my sample while the body's still twitching. 
For this trip, we're going after a bloater. And that means I need you to score a headshot. Think you can handle that? I wouldn't be here if I couldn't. Looks like an infestation. There it is. Good enough. I can work with it. Well, he won't be needing that anymore. What'd you take? Well, look at you. Aren't you curious? I got a sample from his gut, which is hard to do without piercing the outer flesh and making him go boom. Now let's get moving and make this shit somebody else's problem. What are we supposed to learn from this sample? We learn what's up inside these guys. Are they really just bloated corpses? Because last time I checked, popping open a corpse didn't kill everybody in the room. Somehow, that bloater went from human being to chemical weapon in less than a day. Maybe the Zed virus just... Excuse me? Virus? Isn't it a virus? Nobody knows what it is. But it sure as shit ain't a virus. We'd have seen it by now. This is something else. Some much worse. This looks like the place. Okay, that's all we needed. What's going on? There's people eating people out there. Hadley Weston? Yeah? Wait, how do you know my name? Did my dad send you? The governor sent us to bring you home. <laughs> wow. The governor? I'm a little out of it right now. Let's get you some medical attention. Oh, right. Because, like, I am, like, literally starving. I can't believe the Zeds didn't hear that. Hey, look. Uh... What's gonna happen to my grades? Am I, am I gonna have to repeat this semester, or what? We don't work for the college, Mr. Weston, but I'm not sure that's something to worry about at the moment. Oh, right, yeah, of course. I mean, <laughs> obviously. Hey, what if we get attacked? I totally need a gun, right? We are here to protect you, Hadley. You don't need a weapon. Uh, you know, I have a First Amendment, right? Second Amendment. Whatever. I'm not a lawyer. Seriously, why can't I have a gun? Because I've listened to you talk. Whoa, you've got like a whole zombie base. This is friggin' rad. Please. Go inside and just don't do anything until the helicopter arrives.
Dr. Horn made several visits to a medical examiner named Timothy Hall just in the past week. If these visits had anything to do with the outbreak, that office may contain some of the earliest known samples of the disease. The ME's office is on lockdown, so there's a good chance of survivors. If Hall is alive, get him out of there. If he's dead, then just send us whatever you can find. Wilco, sir. Black Friday out. Army? I can't believe it. I thought I was the only one left alive. Dr. Hall, we're actually here to get something from you. Is this about those bodies they brought in last week? I was right, wasn't I? They all had the same weird pathology, even though they came from completely different sources. Do you still have any samples? Yes. Um, around here, somewhere. Sorry, this place is a mess. I, I'll gather up what I can. I guess we'll just have to get you back alive then, huh? Like every body they brought in last week had this infection that wasn't an infection. You didn't call the CDC? Nobody was dying of a disease. And these were accident victims, homicides, heart attacks. I didn't want to start a whole thing over a few weird cadavers. This is your base. It's a command outpost. We call it Black Friday. You know, because of all the crowds trying to get inside. Received a request for assistance on a supply run. Transmitting coordinates now.
can't carry that much. 